Everybody already know who it is. I'm um, just doing a video response. Check out the video at the bottom. The first video is when the kid Casey was being bullied. You know I did a video response on that one or whatever. The kid Casey was being bullied. I'm going to have the first video, what I'm doing a video response to. The second video of him, you know, the fight, what happened. I don't know if the video is up. They might remove it or whatever, but you probably already seen it. But um, the bully is trying to say that he is the victim now. You ever just... You never like seen like a school fight and like you know who started the fight and then the bully seemed like when they get in like a big you know like a big trouble or something like that they always play the victim role like you know back in the day I used to get bullied or oh, they just talk about you know my mom died or, you know just some crazy stuff I had a bad day you know try to make up excuses and then the parents are so in denial. You know, I hate parents that's in denial. Like, my kid is good. And you listen to these parents and look at them. Sometimes you, you try not to judge people. But when you look at their parents and see and look at different stuff, you like, come on now. The kid is like the bully, the little Slim Jim kid is like, that's his name. That's that's what his name going to be. Slim Jim kid got a, pe a piercing. And he's only like 12 years old. When I was 12 years old, I didn't have a... Don't they have like a Power Ranger turbo toy? Get out of here. So, I'm not understanding that part. You can tell this kid is trying to, you know, and if you go to, what is it, 5 minutes and 38 seconds. I'm trying to remember the seconds. Go to like 5 minutes. You're going to see him, the um, the guy interview him and ask him, uh, are you sorry for what you did? He says no. Now, he's trying to blame Casey like Casey started it. And you can tell and look at this kid and say, I can't see him starting. I just can't see it. You know what I mean? This kid, Casey, been bullied. He said for like maybe four years, probably longer than that, you know? Because, you know, like the kids like to make fat jokes. Look at this fat kid, blah, blah, blah. He seemed like one of the, the bully seemed like one of the kids that, you know, trying to get his rank up, all that stuff, trying to, you know, the class clown, as you would call it. And like watching this interview with him, it's like he don't even care, you know what I mean? He paused and said, first he said no. Then he looked at his dad and he said yes. Then he asked him again. He said no. So I just don't, you know, shout out to Casey. You know what I mean? Because, you know, he, you know, it's a lot of bullies out in the world that need to get their ass beat for real. But um, I don't know. They always play the victim role. Like, you know, this person started it. And we all can tell and just look at situations and, and just different stuff. You know what I mean? I'm kind of like, you know, it's like mad lock and lawn. <laughs> and like a lot of people... I don't know. Bullies like to do that stuff and just make their self feel better. Even bullies online, you know, the trolls, as you would call it, internet, whatever. They'll make comments and all that stuff just to mess with you until you snap out and then they play out the all. Oh, uh, you know, I was, you know, playing around. I, you know, I was, uh, people used to bully me back. No, we don't believe you. You need a million people. But shout out to Casey, man.